the Kipco Champion Stakes is next. And another biggish field for this one, 15 of them. And a turn to go around this time. And 10 furlongs is the trip. And at the top it's Alpha Squad for Joshua Sutherland, Caveman, Derek Hinton, Celestial Path, John Morgan, Costa Mesa coming, Vinnie Gerard, Edge Diaz, Bailey, Craig Allen, Galo Chop, John Morgan, Hookham, Dan Hughes, Illawalla Briscoe, da Derek Hinton, one fours, Craig, one fours, in fact, Craig Allen, Picasso, Leon Van Rensburg, Trapanga Lavella, Darren Thompson, ultimately Brooke David Robertson, Zinji Place, Vinnie Gerard, Elderberry Symphony, Dan Hughes, and Doc Del Rama for Darren Thompson. Here's your field then, all installed, ready to go, and away they go. Oh, I can see it, so I'll see it. Uh, right over on the far side, it's Galo Chop, who's gone out into the lead. The one is a little bit slow to go, is Edge Diaz Bailey. And through the first furlong, uh, sorted themselves out. Galo Chop's going to try and get over to the rail. His stable mate, Celestial Path, is keeping it warm for him. And it's a Morgan 1 2. And the next question is going to be can anything get past them? With the other one, a Briscoe in third. Then HDS Bailey and Ultimate Brooklyn Alpha Squad and Duck Del Rama. Caveman's after that, looking to the back Zingy place. And one force at all's about Vinnie Gerard's other horse. Costa Mesa Cummin is also out in the back as well. So they're obviously going to try and come with a late rattle, but those late rattles have not been working today. The leaders have been staying in the lead quite a lot of the time. And Galo Chop is the current leader, leading by two to Illawala Briscoe. In second, the grey rider on the far side is Elderberry Symphony. Duck Del Rama has moved through into fourth. Then ultimately, Brook and Com Celestial Path with Caveman next to that one. And for Squad, is wide on the trap. Probably widest of all. Probably going to lose the most ground on this turn. Also struggling at the back is Picasso. Going to lose a bit of ground on the turn as well. But it's Galo Chop who's going to lead them into the straight then with a lead of a couple of lengths to the wall of greys chasing ultimately brook duck del rama elderberry symphony is after that one then now illawala briscoe is going to try and get back into again look at this costa mesa coming he started his run a little bit earlier on it this time and he's getting into second place but galo chop is still the leader with two to go galo chop in front costa mesa coming and ultimately brook a second and third then comes illawala briscoe and duck del rama elderberry symphony is still there they've got to get past galo chop costa mesa coming he's still trying to close so too is ultimately brooke but galo chop is battling on him a lead half a furlong to go galo chop but here comes costa mesa coming and costa mesa coming sweeps into the lead and costa mesa coming takes it from ultimately brooke out of symphony in duck del rama hookham didn't get going at all today picasso was out the back and costa mesa coming done that a few times this season Swept through in the final furlong. Took a long time to get into the lead though today. But Costa Mesa Cummins taking it for Vinnie Gerard. Ultimately, Brooke David Robertson was second. Elderberry Symphony Dan Hughes was third. The other one, Briscoe, was fourth for Derek Hinton. And Galo Chop dropped back to be fifth for John Morgan.